Pleomorphic adenoma is a benign epithelial tumor of the salivary glands, or usually of the salivary glands, that shows epithelial, myoepithelial, and mesenchymal differentiation. Um, it is most common in the parotid gland, and it is slow-growing, benign, and usually well-circumscribed. It is outlined by fibrous capsule, as we can see it here. And in the periphery, we, see, we can see the remnants of uh, the salivary gland. Um, <clears throat> quite characteristic for this tumor is uh, that we can see two types of uh, uh, two, uh, two components, two types of differentiation, which is quite unusual. So one differentiation is epithelial and myoepithelial. We can see it here. And the second component is mesenchymal stroma. Um, <clears throat> the epithelial component uh, can uh, be um, quite variable. Uh, it can be, it can create the different uh, structures. We can see different types of growth, and therefore the name pleomorphic adenoma. Uh, on a higher magnification, we see the classic. A structure which is trabecules or strands of these epithelial cells uh, with um, oval shaped nuclei. Some of them sometimes look like plasma cells. Um, also, very common uh, is to see uh, these duct like structures or glandular structures, as we can see it here. Uh, and in between the epithelial cells, we can see the mesenchymal component, which is stroma. The stroma can have uh, <clears throat> mixoid uh, appearance, as in, uh, for, for example, here, we see the mixoid cells, and, uh, <clears throat> and the mesenchymal mixoid cells are usually spider-like uh, with, uh, uh, with these cytoplasmic <clears throat> Uh, thin strands. That's mixoid stroma. And uh, here we see very common chondroid differentiation. So this stroma looks like cartilage. Um, <clears throat> so that's also very common. Sometimes we can see cystic differentiation. So here we see some cyst with uh, erythrocytes, with uh, hemorrhage. And uh, on the periphery, we see the fibrous capsule. There is no infiltrative infiltration into the adjacent tissue. Uh, sometimes uh, we can see uh, carcinoma uh, that was transformed from the uh, prior pleomorphic adenoma. This tumor is called carcinoma ex pleomorphic adenoma. So we need to pay attention and we need to check for, for this uh, type of transformation. The carcinoma can be seen inside of the tumor or it can be associated with infiltration to the adjacent structures, so carcinoma uh, with infiltration beyond the capsule. But that's not what we see here. So this is normal benign pleomorphic adenoma. This is quite characteristic uh, pleomorphic adenoma. Uh, thanks for watching.